think the most interesting thing about watercolor is that all the marks you make stick around. Everything you do leaves a trace. So you can't really hide anything you've done. The paints are transparent for the most part and the paper is absorbent, so it's all out there in the open, the whole history of the process. Some people find that intimidating, but I think it's exciting. It makes the painting process feel kind of like a performance, like uh, playing a musical instrument. Uh, you can make some adjustments after the fact, unlike with music, but you don't really get an entire second chance. With watercolor, it's more like you get one and a half chances, and that's usually enough. I like to paint pictures involving transparent and fragile and vulnerable subjects in difficult situations in order to explore my own feelings about the transience of life and the inevitability of difficulty and darkness, but also keeping that whole gloomy existential angle at arm's length with humor and light. My goal is to find the perfect balance between light and dark, between beauty and those awful truths, and between humor and horror. When I was young, my family lived in an Audubon wildlife sanctuary in New England, and I was fascinated by all the birds and insects in the thousands of acres of woods that surrounded our house. I thought I would grow up to be a biologist at that time, but it turns out what I really liked was just drawing all those birds and other animals, which I did obsessively, and of course still do. When I started this body of work 13 years ago, I set out to make paintings that don't look at all like traditional watercolors. So I use staining pigments and smooth paper, and I really push the contrasts where the white of the paper and the light transparent areas are set off by intense dark backgrounds that I apply in one pass with a big brush so I can get an effect like a curtain or uh, an aurora borealis at the edges of those deep black velvety depths. I do find it gratifying when people come up to me and say, they can't believe my paintings are really watercolors. It makes me feel like I'm on the right track.